boom welcome back to the channel everybody as you can see got a full day of riding today and we're on the bullet we're on lewis so uh, with that being said roll that intro Welcome back to the channel. Here's my mic. Can you hear me now? Yes. So, oh, what a disaster I've had. Hi, verse. I'm shouting Jim. Yeah, check out his look. He's a reg. Pew. Dear, oh dear. So, um, yeah, got a full day of riding today. We're going up to Colchester. Going to uh, order the other bolt for the exhaust. And I'm also going to book the bike in for just a quick oil change and uh, maybe air filter. Um, because I'm not too happy with what Superbike did when they handed the bike over. I'm, uh, I'm not 100% that they've uh, done what they're supposed to have done. So I've done over a thousand miles now on the bullet. So I'm going to get a uh, yeah. I'm going to get them to do an oil change. I think it should be prudent. I think just get the basics done. The rest of the bike is, is functioning fine. Oh yes, and to get them to look at the pilot stroke side light let's get to the front here so yeah i had um yesterday was a, a complete write-off i um i went out on on the uh, speed triple on tom take you for a ride it's been a while so i thought i'll tell you what went up to bury st edmunds went out to visit my sister and uh, the bloody microphone right at the end of my journey my Lavellia, whatever you want to call it, microphone, burst, uh, broke on me, so um, totally ruined all my footage. Well, not all of the footage, so I decided, well, I'll tell you what, yeah, cut me losses. Yeah, so annoyed, and to cap it all off as well, I went and left my batteries at my sister, so my spare battery, so that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to go over to Colchester, I've got a full day of riding, I'll go over to Colchester, sort that out, and then um, later on, towards dusk I'm gonna go pop up to Harlow to take the back roads up there and uh, go recover my spare batteries that my sister's got in and say hello to the then um yes yeah oh absolutely bloody GoPros if they're not glitching or whatever um yeah thing is I've never had a microphone like that go actually the wires I'll put a, a clip on here the wires actually come disconnected for a minute I thought the adapter had gone and I've, all, I've already got a spare adapter so I went through the whole fault finding process and uh, checked everything out and it was all, all okay. It was turned out it was the microphone when I took it out. Yeah, the wires had come undone. Absolute nightmare. Oh well. The other thing I found was it's a bit much as well for me riding the speed triple still. Um, I'm glad I've got my little Enfield at the minute. This I can cope with. I mean, the, the Speed Triple is probably on par weight-wise, but I, I definitely notice it in the corners and that. What with my stoner and that, I, I just can't. It's too much for me. So um, I'll probably just use it for the time being, just for small trips uh, until I can get fully recovered, because it's just not. It's not safe. You don't want to be riding when you. If you can't, if you can't, you know, use your body, move your body around to. Um, when you're riding then yeah it's too sketchy so yes um i'm just going to ride that for small trips i think and uh, because it, it obviously involves a lot more concentration because there's a lot more power and yeah just wore me out so i think i'll be doing that from now on until i've had my operation stomach operation but i've got to have a couple on my arms as well um once i've had that done hopefully i'll be at 100 percent and then i can uh, Enjoy the speed triple as it should be. Check me out looking in my mirror. Anyway, let's crack on. Got 
some absolutely amazing snaking winding roads down here. Brilliant. This is excellent stuff. Look at this. Even with a BMW 1 Series in the way. Bit of a sketchy place to break down. Oh, it's like he's got a puncher. Jesus, how's he going to sort that out on there? Oh, dodgy as. Okay, way Zap, where are you taking me? Taking me down to Fingering Home Ranges this way. I say, I remember coming down here. Pretty short grenade range down here. Been a while. Fingering Ho Ranges. Sounds filthy, doesn't it? Do you know what? I think I found my mojo. I think my mojo's back as well. I am absolutely loving riding this bike. I saw um, an Aussie guy. I'll put his name up here somewhere. I can't remember his name, his channel, but um, he put it right. I've, I've never heard it before. Well, I think I have heard it before, but he says, you can't make a fast bike slow, but you can make a slow bike fast. Well, you have fun doing it that way. Anyway, something like that. Um, and I'd have to agree with him. Hello, white van man, you behave yourself. the tick in the road do you know what you have to have insurance for them as well it's bonkers isn't it don't have to have insurance for um, bicycles electric bicycles but you've got to have them for the electric scooters what is all that about unless you're using the uh, the ones that you pay for I'll tell you what that was a good ride up that I enjoyed that even though we were stuck behind a few cars uh, let's have a look Gonna find somewhere to park up and then I'm gonna grab myself a bacon sandwich. Right, we're all booked in, let's move the camera down. Uh, check out all these bikes. Look at it, we've got a uh we got a Guzzi. We got the uh what are they the 9T in it? They're nice, I like them. Obviously my bike looking gorgeous and uh oh, check out that Kawasaki Z900. Very nice lovely jubbly right so bike is uh, booked in for next week and while i was there as well i'll put it up on the screen um they got the 650 meteor i do like the look of that i uh asked them if they got a demo unfortunately they've not got a demo they sold it so uh, but they do have a used one so touch wood I might be able to uh, take out a used one for a, uh, a demo ride so I'm hoping when I uh, put my bike in next week for a service I'll kill two birds with one stone go take that one out for a demo ride see how it rides I sat on it I sat on one of the ones in the uh, the shop and uh, yeah very comfy I like the peg the uh, foot pegs are right out in front it's a proper relaxed riding position looks amazing and obviously it's 650 engine a little bit bigger than uh, the bullet right let's get a move on oh yeah I forgot to mention uh, bumped into a uh, nice chap who watches the videos and uh, I think he said he was on his CB 500 so uh, yeah if you're watching this nice to see you Hope you enjoyed it in Colchester, Kawasaki. Right, I think I'm going to make a, uh, a tactical command decision. I think I'm going to uh, not go to the sisters and pick up the batteries later because um, I'm a bit pooped. My stamina just ain't what it used to be. Bloody stomas, all these injuries sort of wiping me out. Anyways, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tag on the bit of um, footage 
from me on the street chipple last night so I'll, uh, I'll play that now I hope you like that. That was me on the street trip all, like I said earlier. Uh, I'm only about 60% when it comes to riding that, so uh, I can't get the best out of it. So I need to uh, just keep that to small trips, I think, because that probably knackered me out riding that yesterday. So um, I'm off now to Sainsbury's, go pick up some ACF 50. Um, I'm not going to take you along with me to that because that's going to be super, super boring. So with that being said, I'm going to end the video here now. So if you like the videos, give us a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, smash that red subscribe button. And if you are a subscriber, hit the notification bell. That way, every time this idiot uploads a video, you get notified. And that is Jim Diesel out. Check out this corner. Oh, it's like being at Monza. Oh, Monza in Essex. The bullet is loving this. Look at this lovely sweeping left hander. It gets even better down the bottom here. Let's have a look. Woo! Here we go. Very nice. Woo! Yeah, baby.